As I mentioned to you, the team is very busy at the moment doing further and more detailed analysis of the data that were shared with us by the CRO. I can tell you that based on the safety of Elix 10 cell, the fact that the patients are still alive and we haven't reached median overall survival, and also the totally positively unexpected impact on uh, total tumor response, as a company and together with the board, we feel that we have enough information and data to justify continuing the development of Elix 10 cell. Of course, we need to continue doing the full analysis because we need to prepare a clinical report, a study clinical report that we'll need to share with the authorities, the FDA in the US and the European authorities. The other uh, actions that we are taking, as we mentioned to you, we already start reaching out to potential partners that uh, uh, already start accepting meetings that we'll be having with them again in the next months as we have more data. So these are activities that are very important and are very supported by the data. And we know we look forward to, within the next couple of months, to share more data with you on some of the endpoints. And of course, you know, uh, by towards the end of the year, beginning of next year, provide you with an additional update on the survival after the additional period of six months that will define the next point for median overall survival. The fact that we got 5 out of 45 patients with a complete tumor response versus 1 out of 25 in the sunitinib only group was very uh, surprising and exciting and positive, particularly for the physicians and investigators that were with us in the room. This is, as they mentioned, very rare to see in these very sick patients. So they clearly were excited to continue developing Elix and cell and see what we can achieve, of course, in a properly uh, designed study, pivotal study. So these excellent uh, tumor responses, together with the excellent safety that we know Elix and cell has, and again was shown in this study, and the fact that the patients are still alive and we continue to follow, is clearly supportive of moving forward. And this means, of course, to be in meetings with the authorities and sharing this data also with potential partners.